हेलो आई एम ए आई एंकर सना वेलकमिंग यू ऑल इन आज तक ए आई स्पेशल शो ए आई टू जी लेट्स है लुक ऑन बिग ए आई एंड टेक अपडेट्स अराउंड द वर्ल्ड टूडे आई आई टी मद्रास इज ऑफरिंग अ टू ईयर फेलोशिप एट आर बी सी डी एस ए फॉर ग्रेजुएट एंड पोस्ट ग्रेजुएट स्टूडेंट्स इन डेटा साइंस एंड ए आई एप्लीकेंट्स अंडर ट्वेंटी सेवन ईयर्स ओल्ड विद रेलिवेंट डिग्रीज कैन रिसीव अ फोर्टी थाउजेंड रुपीज मंथली स्टाइपिंग द फेलोशिप इन्वॉल्व मेंटरशिप इंटरक्शन विद इंस्टीट्यूशन लाइक गूगल एंड एम आई टी एक्सेस टू कंप्यूटर आर्किटेक्चर एंड कोर्स क्रेडिट रिसिपियंट्स कैन पब्लिश रिसर्च एंड प्रेजेंट एट कॉन्फ्रेंसिस ऑफन लीडिंग टू सक्सेसफुल करियर्स IIT Madras also collaborates on free AI courses in Indian languages. The fellowship aims to empower young researchers in AI and data science through financial aid and industry exposure. US educators are shifting from banning AI tools like ChatGPT to actively promoting their use in academics. Around 30% of college students utilize ChatGPT for schoolwork with positive impacts on GPA. AI focused groups on platforms like Facebook are forming to discuss integration into various disciplines. Experts emphasize AI's importance in preparing students for the future job market. Challenges include potential over-reliance, privacy concerns, and academic integrity. Schools are providing training to address these challenges and ensure effective AI integration while safeguarding critical thinking and ethics. During the G20 Digital Economy Ministers meeting, Prime Minister Narendra Modi introduced Bhashini, an AI-powered translation software aimed at bridging India's digital divide. The platform, part of the Digital India Initiative, facilitates digital service access for non-English speakers by offering translation into various Indian languages. Bhashini, launched under the National Language Technology Mission, uses open-source models and NLP to empower startups, MSMEs, and innovators. PM Modi stressed global collaboration for technological solutions and highlighted India's role as a testing ground for innovative ideas due to its cultural diversity and technical prowess. The Maharashtra government is adopting a blockchain-based system to ensure transparent and corruption-free transfers of regional transport office RTO inspectors. The move aims to eliminate unethical practices in the transfer process and establish fairness. Chief Minister Eknath Shinde has directed that transfers be conducted online to combat malpractice. Blockchain technology will ensure transparency with inspectors receiving one-time passwords for secure and tamper-proof transactions. While some inspectors welcome the move for curbing bribery, concerns about inconvenient postings in remote areas have also emerged within the community. Meta is poised to launch the web version of Threads, its competitor to the X platform, formerly Twitter, aiming to address limitations and declining user numbers. CEO Mark Zuckerberg announced upcoming enhancements, including a search feature. Threads initially saw rapid adoption with over 100 million users but suffered an 82% drop in daily active users to 8 million by July. The release timing remains uncertain with internal testing ongoing. The move indicates Meta's commitment to refining its offerings and competing in the evolving social media landscape. That's all for now in AI to Z. Thanks for watching Arch Tak AI. We will meet next time in next show. Keep watching Arch Tak AI. Goodbye.